We're going to room four. Okay, let's go. During a heart attack, unless treatment is almost immediate, damage will be permanent. But scientists say that might change if they could somehow transplant stem cells into the heart to help rebuild it. The problem is no one's been able to tell how or why the stem cells work until now, thanks to these tiny sensors that are essentially tattooed onto the heart. They give a signal, quick magnetic resonance signal, and this signal will give information about the oxygen concentration surrounding the crystal in this. Dr. Perion and Kupasami of Ohio State University Medical Center says this technology is the first to non-invasively measure how much oxygen is getting to an organ inside the body. In a recent study, it showed higher oxygen levels and better function after stem cells were transplanted into a damaged heart, a therapy that could someday help patients like Nelson Smith. The doctor said I had less than four days to live and less than a 5% chance of making it. Thanks to a heart transplant, Nelson did make it. And thanks to this technology, doctors may someday be able to monitor cases like his by tracking oxygen levels of transplanted organs. For now, it's only being tested in the lab, but given its promise, it could make a difference in a lot of diseases. Not only for stem cell therapy, the technology can be used for me measuring oxygen concentration in a variety of other applications, for example, cancer treatment. In any situation, oxygen is essential to help the body heal. And this technology allows doctors to monitor its levels inside the body like never before. At Ohio State University Medical Center, this is Clark Powell reporting.